All right, so am I. So, hello everyone to the Trackmania Open Full Speed Solo Cup cast. I am here together with Mike and I will give you a good overview, I hope, of the first semi-final. The one semi-final is between Aragon, Dan, Crazy and Sinas. And the other one was between TK, Hun uh, Darkbringer, Hunter and... Who was there as well? I forgot the last name. TEDx. 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 I don't, I don't know that name. I'm not that much into uh, full speed, but I know the best players, of course. And yes, if you would ask me who would win this cup, I would say Mada. But hey, Mada retired from the game, at least for now. So uh, the way is open. Who is going to win the semi-final and this cup? We will see it today. At 7 o'clock we have uh, two semi-finals, one is streamed by me and one by Shadow, I think. Was he called Shadow? Oh yeah. Shadow. And H Hunter is streaming uh, his point of view. And Hunter is streaming the POV. And um, yeah, I will also do the final, Riola will do the final as well. But um, we will see. So uh, let's uh, go to the follow mode here. And I think we can uh, start very soon. And hello everyone in the chat. And Hagrin, thanks for your follow. Tell me guys if everything is alright in the stream. There is no buffering, no weird sound glitches or whatever. To me it looks good on my end. And I think we're gonna start very soon. Are we starting? I guess we are starting. So uh, one warm up and then we will go live. Everything's looking fine. All right, that's good to hear. So I don't know all the maps. I saw only one map uh, just because I jumped into uh, the game. So it's going to be very interesting for me to see how the maps are going for all the players. And uh, who do you guys think is the favorite in the Twitch chat for this match? I really think Dan is the favorite in this semi-final. He also had the highest uh, seeding I saw in the, in the nice uh, screen that Mike made. I think he was first even first and the rest was not even in the top 10 I think or at least uh, not close to the top 8 so uh, it's going to be interesting to see if someone can uh, challenge Dan here for the victory but you need top 2 to advance and it will be very interesting to see who will take the second, sp uh, second spot here and who knows Dan will uh, do something bad and actually lose it. You never know in this game. So for people that are new, we need to go to 120 points. You get 10 points for first, second 6 points, fourth, four, uh, third 4th four, 4 points and 4th 3 points. And when you have 120 points you have a fine list and when you are fine list you need to win one more time to secure your spot. So we are gonna see the first round here, it's actually Sinas taking uh, a small lead here, but there is Dan as well, taking a bit more speed. It's all about speed drifting in full speed mode. And uh, we have a nice overview here from Crazy. It's actually Sinas and Dan fighting it out here for the first spot. Let's see how this will go. Dan going with way wider line, trying to get more speed, but it did not help him. It's a pretty big lead for Sinas here. Looks like he's gonna take the first uh, 10 points. I should give him a big boost to his confidence. Still first. Then is catching up though. He is having more speed. He had more speed slides. But it, the map is already finished, so there we go. Sinas did a 105.7. I have no idea if that is a quick time, because I don't see any daddy manias. But I guess that's a decent time. 
So 10 points for Sinas. Then 6, Aragon 4 and Crazy 3. Yeah, our match started now as well. All yeah, right. Semi-final. Both matches are on the way. And once again, Sinas taking a lead here at this uh, first map. But there, you, there goes Dan. There goes the uh, the lead of Sinas. That is how this uh, full speed works. It's so close. And you can really catch up at the end of a map when you have a, a very good speed slide. And I think Sinas is overtaking everyone again. Yeah, there he goes. He has a better trajectory in the second uh, part of the map. Let's see who's going to catch up in the end. It's a really close match. It's only two tens between all the players. Oh, Dan going really close to the wall there. But he's catching up to Crazy. Will he take over Crazy before the finish? Looks like it. Will he also take Sinas? Oh, he will. He has more speed. And there he goes. 106-1. So not that quick of a time. But still, really nice race there. And then taking the 10 points. Spectate Aragon here. Because he is now having only 4 points. Nothing special here. Now the speed slide speed sliding starts. Who gets the better speed slides? Once again, Dan and Sinas in front. Oh, Dan going so close on that edge there. Holy macaroni. Super close in the front. It will be between Sinas and uh, Dan normally. Unless Aragon makes a huge good trajectory to the end. But that's going to be super hard. Really close race here. Oh, and Sinas uh, drops down. He had a bad uh, line there for his speed slide. And that means that... Uh, and what do we get here? Aragon getting closer. Is he gonna get first? Will he take over Dan? It's super close here. Oh, one hundredth of a second. Between first and second. That was really, really close. But Dan takes another ten points. And that gives him a, a, a very confident lead here. Of course you need to steer, keep going and get first and second places still. The gap is not that big. But what a good end from Aragon there. You see that Sinas is uh, leading most of the time before the speed sliding uh, starts. So I would say it's a bit more tech-like the start of the map. It's just uh, steering and go as tight as possible. And it looks like Sinas is good at that. And Dan as well of course, he's also playing uh, tech with us in uh, some other cups. So that should be good for those two and it looks like once again that is actually happening right now. So let's see if Aragon can get uh, closer again at the end of the map, just like last round. He's uh, really far behind now. This should be too much for 10 so I'm gonna spectate Crazy here. I also don't think Crazy gets uh, quicker. Oh, Crazy! What happened there? What was that? Can he still make it now? What was that, guys? Help me, I'm confused. 105.97. A good time for Dan here. Another 10 points, so he is uh, doing what everyone is thinking. Being the favorite and trying to win. And yes, Sinas is on the second place. I think most of the people would say Sinas here. But not totally sure. I actually bet in the uh, Hunt Mania. Oh no, it's not Hunt Mania anymore. In the NMD betting league that uh, Dan and Sinas will go to the final. That was my opinion. That they are the best two. But prove me wrong. This time crazy with good start. It's forced the warm up. So now I can learn the new map. I did not see these maps. <laughs> Sorry, Eirik. <laughs> I 
I lost another follower, Mike. <laughs> <coughs> so how is it going in the uh, other match, uh, Mike? What is the uh, standing over there? Uh, Hunter's leading, but we started on his map, so he might have a head start, kind of. All right. And the rest is pretty close. Yeah. Ooh, this finish can become uh, very tricky. You want to snipe someone? Oh, and I also lost some points. <laughs> Good luck to all the players. Let's see who will uh, be the best on this map. I will spectate Aragon, since he is fourth, he needs to catch up to the other players. Good start from him. Together with Dan, leading this round. And having a bit more speed here than Dan. Yeah, he is catching even more. Will he take the first 10 points? That would really help him. He needs to do something in the end. Because Dan has more speed. Way more speed. Look at Dan flying away with a better speed drift. And there comes the rest. He's getting fourth again. Oh no, this is not good for him. This is terrible. He had such a good start. And Dan takes another 10 points. And Sinisapple takes another 6 points. Ooh, this is going uh, the wrong way for uh, Ereogon and Crazy here. They are more than 10 points behind the number 2, which will give the qualification spot to the, to the final. And Dan is really on fire, absolutely. Oh no, Ereogon! I think he uh, retired. Yes, he retired. That is unfortunate. Another bad round for him. Pressure is catching him, I think. So let's see what Crazy can do against uh, Dan and Sinas here. It still looks like... Oh my goodness! Sinas taking the, the corner a bit too tight there, getting a small bump. So easy round for Dan, if he doesn't make a mistake. Oh, and Crazy! What is happening? Also retired. If two retires now... So, this can conclude the match pretty quickly if it continues like this. Let's see what time Dan will do here. I have no clue what a good time is here, but this looks like a good time. 106.67 for Dan and Sinas with 6 points. Crazy and Aragon with 0. And that means that the... Uh, the top two is uh, getting very confident now that they are going to make it. And it's up to Crazy and Aragon to, to just try to sneak a win. They need to win rounds. At least get second multiple times to have a chance. And we once, once again saw uh, Aragon going really wide at the start. Yeah, it's the same two again. The pace is clear to me. It's clear almost who is going to get first and second. And we are not even halfway. But you can just see the difference. And where's Aragon? Did he crash again? Looks like it. He is 1.8 seconds behind. I don't know if there is some prestige for the third place, but it looks like it's going that way. Oh, and there goes Signas. He has no more speed. Crazy will overtake at the end. No. It was really close. Almost six points for Crazy to catch up to Sinas. But it ha didn't happen. So once again, 
a first and second place for Dan and Sinasapple. More, no, almost 20 points ahead. That's a lot of points. We are on round number... I can't see it. I think four. Oh, what happens now? Everyone is crashing! But Sina's DNF'd. Aragorn DNF'd. Three ten points for Dan. But two points for Crazy. So he will catch up to Sina's for the second place. If he doesn't make a mistake. He will be within ten points again. Which is crucial. So it's not over. What was that mistake from Sinas? That was uh, really bad. And he knows it. Let's see what time Dan will do this time. No, there is no one uh, trying to fight him in this semi-final. He's by far the best. He's on a decent time. He doesn't need to risk. He really wants the 10 points. And it's again a 106.6, so a very good Rago here from Dan. And uh, someone is saying default to the is to the ESL blocks. <laughs> oh really? Crazy is saying easy money. <laughs> yep, <laughs> you can say that. We are going to Never Ending Cycle, a map made by Hunter himself. I don't know this map, I think. Or did I train this one when I joined the server? Don't remember. But the, the battle for second is not over, guys. It's only 13 points. That can really be catched up too. The 76 points is too much. Especially with the form of Dan. He should pretty easily win this cup. This semi-final uh, match, at least. The final is going to be somewhat different. Because... Uh, the other big players are in the other semi-final. It's going to be a super nice semi uh, grand final, I think. Dan now driving in the Netherlands car. Always good to see. <laughs> Hunter will scary Dan. Yes, of course. We all know what he can. We all know what Hunter can do. Hunter is leading quite uh, quite a bit already in the other match. What is the score on the other semi? Uh, Hunter is at 56, Darkbringer is at 44, TK at uh, 34, and Tedix at 28. Yeah, so also dominating a bit. But not as much as Dan in this match, of course. He just got a round where he was the only one to finish, so that uh, oh. put him quite a bit ahead. Wow. Rather close before. Was it on, the, on uh, the last map that we saw? Uh, we have another map order. Okay. Because that map was not that hard to finish, but maybe it's an, uh, there is a map in the pack that is really hard to uh, finish when you make a small m a mistake. But uh, there we go, round number one on Never Ending Cycle. I am going to spectate Crazy because he is the one to fight for a qualification spot here. And this time, good start from Crazy, but then having a small edge again. Oh, but what happens here? Did Crazy have a better... Yes, what happened to Dan? He's losing all his speed, he's now fourth. And the battle for first is really close. Seen up with more speed, better landing. The last speed drifts will decide who's gonna win this round. And it looks like Sinas is going to win at the moment. More, he is, he is driving away. This should be his round. And there we go. Sinas with a 58.28. And winning the round. And going further from the third place. So it looks like the gap is now getting too much again. It's almost 20 points that Crazy needs to overtake Sinas Apple. Round number two. Mm -hmm. 
close start from all the, sp all the players. No big mistakes. Aragorn going with a way wider line. I guess he's trying to catch more speed with the speed drift. It's not really working at the moment. He is not catching up. Will Sinas catch up to crazy? It looks like it. Can Sinas do... What? Oh, what? Dan retired. Dan made a mistake. And it looks like Sinas is catching up for first place once again. He actually is. Sinas driving away at the last part of this map. Just like the previous round. He is really controlling the end. And oh my goodness. A snipe from Aragorn. With one thousand of a second for second place. Which is not helping Crazy at all. Actually Crazy is almost getting fourth now. And that really helped Sinas by gaining more advantage over the number 3 and 4 of this match. 1,000th of a second. But what happened to Dan last round? I, I, I guess he was trying to do a really good time or something. Because he just uh, was first and crashed. Once again, Dan is by far the first player. Look at this, uh, at his lead here. Over two tenths. We should just... Oh my goodness! Aragorn with <laughs> big crash! That was not, uh, not good at all. He just banged into the, in, into the track there. And it looks like it will be between Dan and Sinas. And Sinas once again at the end of this map catching up to Dan and all the other players. Sinas really understands this ending. But it was not enough. It is still Dan first, Cena second. And uh, Dan is catching up. He is almost at 100 points. He is now at 89. Cena's at 68. Crazy 41. Aragorn 32 points. Let's see if Cena's will catch up again at the end of this map. Looks like he is really nailing it. They are driving in the order of the points, but there goes Crazy with a more inside line, and it actually pays off. So the inside line looks like it's quicker. Or it just had a super good drift, I don't know. I'm not a full speed pro. But um, he really catched uh, some time in with that inside line there. And there comes Aragorn with a lot of speed, overtaking everyone. From 4th to 1st in one turn. Sinas Apple, 2nd place. And what an ending from Aragorn there, holy. What did he do? He just catched everyone. Nice 10 points there. 58.33 on this map. Not the best time. But good enough for 10 points, and that's all that matters. We are going to the fourth map. This is TMO Tides of Time, made by Firefox. So, wait, is this the map that we played uh, in the beginning? Yeah, that's uh, yeah. three so there, maps. Uh, there are three maps, okay, yeah. We're just on that map right now. All right. Dark bring out the, the 2.5s in a row. Point fives. Wow. Yeah, point fifty and point fifty one. So yeah, everything below one oh six is good, but if you want to beat uh, Darkbringer you need to go quicker than that, apparently. But that's uh, for later. The final of course will be at eight thirty. I will also cast it. Riolo will also cast it. Of course I hope you stay with me. But that's your own choice. So after the warm-up we are live once again. The gap between qualification for Crazy and Aragon is 30 points. That looks like it is too much, but uh, we will see. Ooh, then crashed in the warm up there. Doesn't matter. 106.04, so not below 106, so maybe not fast enough in the match. We will see. Good luck to all the players. And. Why is my camera 
doing weird. I don't know. Let's uh, spectate crazy here again. The start, very tacky. No drifts whatsoever, just inside lines. And here the speed drift starts. Once again, Sinas and Dan, who are also good, are decent at tech. Taking the lead at the beginning. Especially Dan is good at tech. And it looks like Dan is once again having the lead again over everyone. And Crazy is getting too far behind. He did not have a good speech light there. Let's see what Aragon can do in the end. Can he challenge Sinas or Dan? And once again Sinas Apple with a good end. He is catching up to Dan. Will he take over Dan for first place? No, doesn't look like it. No, Dan once again with the 10 points. 106.2, so not quick, but good enough for 10 points. Which means he needs three more wins to get first in this match. First get to 120 points, then you are a finalist and then you have to win again to secure your spot. Who takes the most inside lines here? Sinas Apple this time with a good start. Let's see if he can stay in front. Did he not lose his uh, speed slide there? No, looked like it. It is once again between Dan and Sinas Apple. Dan taking a very other line there, very different line. And it works for him. He is far, having far more speed than uh, Sinas. I don't know what he did different, but uh, look at him driving away. So far ahead. And he's on a really good time as well. What is the dance time? 105.55 for Dan here. Sick time. And another 10 points. He is in the comfort zone. He is in the zone to win this first semi final. And the second spot is almost secured here. That was a very nice time from then. Everyone, every time in 105 is really good. But the 105.55, very promising for the final. To face the other big guys. For the title of the Trackmania Open Full Speed Solo winner. Yeah, he was only two tenths below the world record. That that looks really promising. But this round, it looks like Sinas is uh, going to win. Dan catching up a little bit. Will it be enough? No, it will not be enough. Sinas with a 106.03. This time, that was good enough for 10 points. So he is going... Getting a further lead over Crazy and Aragon. They are nowhere to be seen in this, uh, this semi-final. Except for some rounds. But that is mostly because of the others making mistakes. Yes, 119 points. Dan just needs to finish this round to become finalist. Well, that's a lot of points already. Yeah. This is I mean, the. You're just one map ahead, and uh, yep. Hunter is at 97 over here. Hunter at 97, Darkbringer at 90, uh, Tedix at 55, and TK at 52.
The battle here once again between Dan and Sinas. Let's see what Sinas can do. Go challenge Dan. Dan has way more speed here. Driving away. Catching more speed drift there as well. And uh, let's see what the time of Dan will be after this looping. 105.75. Once again, a really good time. Dan, by far, finalist. He has at least three rounds to get the victory. We are back at Inositol. What a nice name for a map. Inosito L or Inositol. From Brad Armpit. We have one warm up again and we will be live. This map we saw some DNFs from uh, Dan as well I think. Was it this map or the next one? I don't remember. Who knows? Everything can happen. But it looks really good for them. Sinus Apple decides to start over with the warm up. Taking some rest. Sometimes you don't want to warm up the map. You just want to uh, take a bit of a break. Looks like his controller DC. Well, I think I just wanted to say good luck to them. And then just stop driving. It didn't look to me he got any problems. He just stopped because he didn't want to anymore. Maybe he had to sneeze. Well, that's a good... Uh, <laughs> that, that's possible, Spooky. It's absolutely possible. <laughs> An Aragon with a 106.5 looks like a really good time on this map. Yes, it is actually. So let's see if he can do that again. Can someone deny Dan over here? Oh, Aragon with a bad start. What happened to him? What just happened? And crazy clips the wall. It's only Sinas versus Dan for the victory. Will Sinas deny Daniel the victory? Looks like the answer is not. And hello Tobanski. <laughs> Looks like easy victory for Dan. Really nice play from him. Oh, what? He clipped the... Uh, the uh, how do you call it? But he didn't lose any time. Holy shit. Holy shit. He's losing time. Sinas will catch up. No. Then we have 106.88 with the small mistake. So that looks uh, really promising for the final. By far deserved for Dan. Venture Dan. From Germany takes the first position. We will continue for a second. We have uh, Sinas, Crazy and Aragon left. Can Crazy or Aragon do something against Sinas here? Well, in this round they can. While a big storm suddenly out of nowhere comes here in my street. Maybe you can hear the wind. What the hell? What is happening outside? Anyway, who is gonna win this round? It looks like Aragon. Oh, Crazy lost the, the speed slide there. That will not help him. Looks like a nice 10 points for Aragon. He doesn't need to risk that much. Just keep normal speed slides. Don't clip any uh, walls or edges. He can really save it now. Hunter is finalist now. Alright. And the others, how much how many points? Uh Darkbringer 110. And uh TEDx at 67, TK at 58. So also very uh 
decided already if they go uh, how it goes. Yeah, kind of. Who can stop Sinas here? They need so many points. Looks like something that is impossible. But in this game, nothing is impossible. Absolutely nothing. Crazy, catching up a little bit, having a little bit more speed than Sinas here. Once again, catching up pixel by pixel, having a very good trajectory here. They are driving in each other. He is at the lead at the moment. And looks like the gap is too much, so Crazy, once again... Taking. Oh, he goes a bit too wide here. And Aragon as well. Also sniping Sinas at the end. So it was a really good race. But uh, Crazy, once again, 10 points. It's not over. Crazy can continue with the 10 points. As long as Sinas is not winning, they have a chance. Darkbringer just sniped Hunter out of his finalist attempt. Oh, 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 they are both finalists, but still 50 points ahead of the third. Good start from Sinas at the more of some sort of tech part, I would say, with no sliding involved. And this time it is Aragon fighting with Sinas, also crazy, still inside of the range. And there makes Aragon the small bump. It doesn't matter, crazy. Once again, more speed. Going a wider line here to take even more speed out of this uh, wall right. Going wider here again. Maybe to get even more speed. Did it pay off this time? Looks like it. He is driving away like a rocket. From Sinas. What's crazy doing? Did he go crazy? Padoomts. Sorry, that was a bad joke. But look at this crazy. What is his time? 106.84 But uh, that was a really good end of crazy there GG to Hunter over here Hunter won, so Dan and Hunter are now in the final Yeah, and Darkbringer is uh, second finalist attempt now We go back to never ending for the second time this is the 6th map, right? Or the 5th? I don't remember. I think it's the 5th. It's not over here, guys. It's absolutely not over. Was this the map where Sinas nailed the end all the time? I think so. So we should Sinas see catching up at the ending. Aragon and Crazy are smelling the opportunity to actually make it to the final. They can feel it. But they need to do really good. No time to joke around anymore. Yeah, this was the map where Sinas catched up at the end. So let's see if he will do that again. 58.26. Decent time there. Good luck to all the players. Will we see Sidas going to the final or will Crazy or Aragon make an incredible comeback? Is Sidas finalist already? No, he needs two more points. Oh. And the other ones are on 83 and 81. We are live. Let's see what Sinas can do here. Looks like he has a good start. Which is good because this ending 
is really good on this map. Once again, it is crazy fighting with Sinas to deny the 10 points. Oh, not the best line, but still, still in the neighborhood. Oh, Sinas, no! Sinas made a small mistake. <laughs> Can he make it now? <laughs> he actually made it. He just needs to finish for the fi for the finalist. So let's see if he actually can finish. Darkbringer just did a 105.44 in warm up. Oh, that sounds uh, map. incredible. So Sinas is finalist. He he survived. But crazy 93 points. It is absolutely not over. Sinas is feeling the pressure. He should not feel pressure. He is far ahead. Just do normal maps, uh, laps, and uh, you should get at least one time a first place here. Crazy and Sinas and Aragon still very close at the start here. Spectate Sinas, can he actually catch up to Crazy? Crazy driving away with the inside line here that, that worked for him last time. I remember that. But there goes Sinas with more speed. It is really close. Will Sinas become the second finalist? <gasps> I don't know. Looks like a better trajectory for Sinas here. Oh yes, there he goes. There goes Sinas. Nailing the end here once again. This is the Sinas map. This map is for Sinas. And GG. Sinas knows this end like no one else, at least in this match. And that means that Dan and Sinas will go. Can you screenshot uh, the result? Uh, what? Uh, can you screenshot the result? Oh, yes. Nice. If I... Yeah, there we go. Click. So an expected result on this uh, first semi-final. On the other one, looks like an expected result as well. So I guess the best four players of this cup will actually go to the final. And yes, Sinas denying the German final here. Will the final be at uh, 8.30? Yep. Yeah. Alright.